How's everybody doing? I have been looking for these forever. Catfish Redneck. Back on YouTube. Pocky Ghost Pepper. Haunted Ghost Pepper Chips. I seen these several months ago on YouTube. Uh, of course, heard of the Pocky One Chip Challenge. I have looked everywhere with these, and I, I thought, well, if I either, if I want to try them, I'm going to have to order them. Today, I found a store that sells them. So, we're going to try them right here with you folks. If you guys have had these, leave me a comment down there. Let me know how hot they are. I'm about to find out. Uh, ingredients, ground corn, uh, canola oil, salt, ghost pepper, potato starch, cayenne pepper, chipotle pepper powder, cane sugar, natural flavor, yeast extract, onion powder, citric acid, garlic powder, and chili powder. Alright, I'm going to try them. Can't wait. Uh, I found these at Fresh Thyme, spelled like the herb, T-H-Y-M-E, which I guess it makes sense because they're uh, no artificial ingredients, non-GMO, verified. And they had a whole shelf full of them, so now I know where to get them. I'm going to take my jacket off because I think I might start sweating. I don't know. We'll see. I hope they're as hot as they say, haunted. All right, like crispy, freaking hot, witnesses the haunted ghost pepper, the scariest of them all. These chips will terrify your taste buds. Ours are still hiding under the bed. Pocky, haunted ghost pepper. Mmm, got a deep smoky smell. Mmm, it's like I've been waiting so long I'm scared to try it. All right, folks, here we go. I'm sure these won't be a one chip challenge hot, of course, but I hope they give me what I'm looking for. Got that ghost pepper smoky flavor. You don't get that burst of cheese like you do with uh, Doritos. Well, of course, these aren't uh, nacho cheese. These are ghost pepper chips. And I can feel the heat building. That's a good sign. If you haven't heard of these, I'll put a link down there, pocky.com. They are. The heat's building. They got a good taste. I don't think these are going to let me down. No artificial colors, no preservatives, and no artificial ingredients. I can't say that for most of the chips I do. All the ones I've did have about 14 different uh, dyes and colors in them. And this heat is definitely in these. That's good. Got a little Mrs. Renfro ghost pepper left. <coughs> we'll see how that goes with them. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, these, uh, yeah, if you didn't eat spicy food at all, you wouldn't be able to eat too many of these. I'm probably going at a two right now, going up to a three. And for a chip, that's pretty good. Unfortunately, I'll have to go get some more Friday. Yeah, the heat's building. These are actually pretty spicy. That's a good thing. We're going to try some Renfro's ghost pepper salsa with them. Now that is a good snack. I do have, I uh, also found some Reaper salsa from that store today. Hang on, I'll show that to you.
So I'll be uh, tasting this one soon. Yeah, these have got a very nice spice to them. Yeah, if you like hot stuff, try these out. I think that might have just became one of my favorite chips. Those are good. I think these got the blazed Doritos, all the all the Doritos beat, even the spicy nacho and all of them. Definitely. Definitely recommend those. Those are good. I'm glad I finally found them. Orange habanero. spice it up a little. Alright. Good chip. Definitely got some heat. I just watched the hot damn show. Roger ate two nemesis bars. Two squares. And chug pretty much a third, the rest of the third bar in a milkshake. He looked pretty rough. I hope he's okay. Heat 101. Did his Taco Bell challenge tonight? I think I'm going to do that one. Wow, I'm getting some heat now. I love these. $3.49 a bag is what they were at that store. I'm going to be getting some more of them on Friday. Alright folks, I'm going to do another sliver of habanero on them. And we'll get out of here. Yeah, if you like spicy chips, these will not let you down. save some from my habanero salsa. Good chips. Really good chips. The habanero helped out too. Alright folks. Until the next one. Until the next challenge comes along. I got a couple planned. Look for those. Like I said, I found them at uh, Fresh Time. I've checked a dozen other places, and that was the only place that had them. Woo! Yeah, it's got a little heat, folks. All right, Catfish Rednecks out of here. Hope you all enjoy your evening. Uh, I'm even starting to get a little nose running on that. Mm. Good chips, good chips. <laughs>